guys welcome back to the channel girl hope all is well with you guys in today's video we are going to be doing another foundation review we're going to be trying out a foundation from the Ulta beauty line so this is their new complexion crush middle coverage foundation and tilt subline and this is the shade dark neutral this is retail for 14 dollars this is a buildable coverage with a natural finish we don't know much about it but this is all they have on the packaging so this is it here so this is the closest shade to my skin tone and this is cruelty free so i still have this cough that is not going away and i try to take a break from a recording because i don't like coughing in your guys face even though there's a camera i feel like i'm coughing in your guys face every time i try to talk I cough. It's been a month I have this cough. So I'm trying everything and it's still not going away. So so I apologize in advance if you guys hear me coughing, but I'll try my best not to cough. Like I said, this is a medium coverage. It's suitable for most skin types. This super blendable, lightweight foundation feels and moves like a second skin. Ultra Beauty Complexion Crush Foundation easily covers imperfections, blurs skin texture, and even skin tone, but still allows your natural beauty shine through. Okay. Like always, I'm not going to put anything on my skin. I don't have any primer on. It's just bare skin. And I like to do this because I want to see what the foundation looks like on its own. So this is what we're going to do today. I'm going to put it right over here. Foundation brush from BH Cosmetics. And I think I did good, girl. I've been breaking out lately. It's because it's getting really hot, girl. It's getting hot you see I have a big pimple right there so I'm gonna try to like cover it up a little bit and then I have like little pimples this is a good match oh so I picked up the dark was it dark olive I feel like dark olive was a little bit too on on the pink on the tone side so I returned that one and I kept the dark neutral and I really thought dark neutral would have been you know light but she goes on good and I'm also going to bring it down here. Hopefully it don't oxidize. This looks pretty good. And I like to just staple it in so I get a better coverage. If I put a little bit more, I will get a full coverage. But I don't have my contacts on, so I probably will miss a few spots. But I'll be careful not to. Okay, so I really do like this foundation. It blending out really nice. Very smooth. And the coverage is perfect. The shade is really nice. Let me just blend. Let me just go with my hairline for my forehead. Oh, wow. No foundation. Foundation. I don't know if I would recommend this for oily skin as well. It's a little bit too dewy for you guys unfortunately but i have another foundation from alter i was just browsing around in the sales section and that's my favorite place to visit when i'm at the alter store because sometimes they have good deals you just have to really look for them and i got one of their alter foundation for seven dollars i don't know if it's the same complexion crush or it's a different one. I don't know. It's if, I don't really know. I just saw it for seven dollars and I picked it up to try for you guys. So we'll do that in another video. I feel like this one is more for dry skin. It looks very hydrated. I don't think that you guys are gonna like this. It feels really nice. Oh yes, girl. This is my shade. Ooh. Mm. And it's not too dark. I thought it would have been a little too dark let me just bring back my mirror hopefully hmm. i think it's okay the coverage is really nice so, since i have dry skin and i have sensitive skin this foundation feels really comfortable on my skin okay the shade is perfect look at this side girl tell me what you guys think Look at this side. Yeah, girl, I saw it on TikTok and everybody 
like this and i was like wait a minute also has a new foundation i didn't know that so girl here we are following people on tiktok wasting our money well my money not your money because i'm sure you're not gonna get it and i promise myself i'm not gonna be spending a lot of money this year but i've been doing good though but this is a perfect match i love the glow and it actually covers my dark spots really good I don't know how it's going to wear throughout the day, but I'm thinking that I'm going to give this a wear test just to see how it feels and how it looks. Let me show you guys again. This is beautiful. My hair is a mess. So this is how everything looks if you guys are new here i'm very simple when i'm doing wear tests it's just a wear test that we're doing i don't want to put too much products on the face and then mislead you guys so i usually do something very simple so you guys can see what the product looks like the time now is 12 52 it's early in the day and of course we're going to give this a wear test because i want to see how it looks on my skin for a few hours so i probably will come back maybe four o'clock We'll see how I feel, but so far it looks good. I don't have any powder on my face. I really didn't set it. This is good. Like I, I wasn't expecting this to look that good. I heard stuff about the Ultra brand. It's not really good, but this foundation is pretty good. So I'm excited to see how it looks throughout the day. So this is how it looks. It's beautiful. I am so happy I got this foundation. And of course, girl, I'm not gonna return it but i like it it looks really nice this is my shade and i know if i put a little bit of powder on it's gonna look a little lighter than what it is so i'm not worried about it but on its own girl it's perfect so far this is a nice foundation for our oily girls look at this now girl look at this it looks really really nice love it so we're gonna come back in four hours many unbearable hours later All right so it's been four hours okay and i bring the camera a little bit closer so you guys could see the beauty of this foundation girl i do like this foundation it did oxidize it's a little bit more darker but it's not that dark i am gonna keep it because i really do like the finish i like the way it looks it's very hydrated this is how it looks on this side it is a medium coverage but it's really not that bad uh as you guys see there and you guys see here i don't know my skin is just doing this type of breaking out i guess it's trying to get used to the heat so this is not for oily skin like i said in the beginning just having this on my face is yeah you guys not gonna like it unless you put some like a setting powder on top of it uh you probably could get away with it but i think it's more for dry skin it did oxidize i'm looking at my neck i do use my neck for reference as you guys know my neck is very light you probably won't see it on camera that much but as you guys know in the beginning i didn't set it this is what i do on this channel if you're new here i want to make sure that you guys see what the product looks like straight up from the bottle so you guys have an idea how it looks in real life i'm really impressed with this product Alta did a great job and it feels really soft on my skin very 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 soft i love it 
it does transfer okay so this says is a natural matte finish i didn't see this when i started off this is not a matte finish foundation so i don't know where the natural matte finish comes from this don't really feel matte on my skin so i don't know where this claim came from but i'm just letting you guys know from a person that has dry skin i don't feel like my skin is tight or anything medium coverage you do get a medium coverage you can see all my spots on my chin here I have little spots there uh, over here as well you know you can see them poking out but it said it's suitable for most skin types yes I would recommend this for oily skin and if you are oily skin and you try it out and you like it let me know in the comments below how it feels on your skin so if you have oily skin try it out this is just my personal opinion when it comes to foundation but i'm sure there's someone that wears it that has oily skin and don't have a problem if this is your first time here my name is shinen and thank you guys so much for clicking on the video before you leave don't forget to hit that notification bell and also subscribe to the channel if you like this video and thank you guys so much for subscribing to the channel we are growing every single day and i really appreciate each and every one of you guys i'm going to try my best to put up more videos for you guys i'm just trying to get rid of this cough because it's very difficult for me to talk but i'm trying my best but i hope you guys enjoyed either way to my ogs thank you guys so much for returning i really appreciate you guys let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this product but thank you guys so much see you guys in the next video